Hello everyone, Philip Miller here once again with the Orange Pi Neo. Today we look at controls. First we start up the device as usual. Now we take a look on the UI. Do you see the difference? Well, let's point it out. Here we have the Steam menu. So why the heck the Orange Pioneer has the Steam button here? Well, let's see. We go to settings. We go to controller. And we start the test. So here you have it. We emulate the Steam controller. So what is working here? Well, trackpads are working both sides. We have the triggers. We have the joysticks and we have all the clickies. The only thing what is not where is here they don't go away so it's just like how we report it there. We will fix that at some point so it's an early version of the port. We can also go now to gyro and see if it works. Well, yes it does. So here you see all the movements. What is not working yet is Calibrate. So it just doesn't do anything here. But the stock settings are okay. So we will fix that as well. Let's give it a pace in a game like Portal to see how it works. Let's load the game, we go to test chamber 10. So normal right joystick, movement forward, backward, left and right. We have the joystick where we can turn around. We have the button for the 180 degree. We can jump down. We can fire with the triggers, we can jump, we can duck, we can use something and we can use the right trackpad for navigation of the camera and if we hold it we can trigger the gyro. So movements are working as designed. So I also made this button to trigger the gyro to see that function as well. So you can add the buttons here as you want. So full Steam input works on games. Let's see about the desktop. So we're switching now here to Plasma 6 on Wayland and here Steam is starting in the background so we have here the trackpads so it will ask if we want to share it so we confirm so now we can use the trackpad and shake it to have the bigger cursor we can use the joystick to navigate. We can use the touchpad of the screen. And if we use a Steam and X, the keyboard will pop up. So I can open a terminal here and we can type something. and trigger enter so hello the application is not there we can hide with B and if we want we can tap into and have 
the on-screen keyboard from KDE. So you have two versions on how to type on the Neo. So that's it for this video. Stay tuned for more news.